Projection to home. Project yourself mentally to be standing in front of your home, standing about 30 feet 10 meters from it. Look at your home. You have been here many times. Begin scanning the scene at the upper left-hand corner, going slowly from left to right, as you do when reading a book, going lower each time until you reach the ground level. Pause. Study colors as you do this. What color is the roof? Pause if there is a tree in front of your house. What color is the tree? Pause. Study details. Recall what you have seen. Remember it. Remembering what you have seen is called visualizing. Pause. Allow yourself enough time to do this. Then, when you reach the ground level, focus your attention on the front door and concentrate on the doorknob or handle. Pause mentally move close to the door. Close enough to touch the door handle. Expect the door to appear to increase in size as you get closer. Pause mentally touch the doorknob or handle. Open the door. Mentally enter your home. Closing the door. Behind you. Pause. Mentally walk toward your living room. Once you have entered your living room, stand at the center, facing the south wall. Pause you have been here before. You have been here during daylight hours. You have been here during nighttime with the lights turned on and with the lights turned off. It is now daytime. You are standing at the center of your living room, facing the south wall. You have been here before. You know how much light enters this room during the day and you recognize what is in front of you. Pause what is behind you. Pause you know what is to your left. Pause and what is to your right. Pause. Now we will change the scene to nighttime with the house lights turned on. The scene has changed to nighttime and you are still standing in the middle of the living room, facing the south wall. You have been here before and you know what is in front of you, pause what is. Without anybody guiding you, then it will be easier to do it one segment at a time. Give it time to work. After you do these mental projection drills at your center, the alpha level, it is important for you to give them time to work. After you come out of your level, do something else and let your experiences settle in. If you work with a partner who reads the exercise to you, do not talk about your experiences afterward until you've had a chance to sleep on it. Mr. Silva said it is like planting a seed. You need to give it time to sprout. You can't dig it up to look at it right away. Once you have gone through at least one sleep and dream cycle, about 90 minutes of sleep, then it is okay to talk about it if you feel there is a need to. Now when you are ready, here is what we want you to do. Projection to home. Project yourself mentally to be standing in front of your home, standing about 30 feet 10 meters from it. Look at your home. You have been here many times. Begin scanning the scene at the upper left-hand corner, going slowly from left to right, as you do when reading a book, going lower each time until you reach the ground level. Pause. Study colors as you do this. What color is the roof? Pause if there is a tree in front of your house. What color is the tree? Pause. Study details. Recall what you have seen. Remember it. Remembering what you have seen is called visualizing. Pause. Allow yourself enough time to do this, then. When you reach the ground level, focus your attention on the front door and concentrate on the doorknob or handle. Pause mentally move close to the door, close enough to touch the door handle. Expect the door to appear to increase in size as you get closer. Pause mentally touch the doorknob or handle. Open the door, mentally enter your home, closing the door behind you. Pause, mentally walk toward your living room. Once you have entered your living room, stand at the center, facing the south wall. Pause you have been here before, you have been here during daylight hours, you have been here during nighttime, with the lights turned on, and with the lights turned off. It is now daytime, you are standing at the center of your living room facing the south wall. You have been here before, you know how much light enters this room during the day, and you recognize what is in front of you, pause what is behind you, pause you know what is to your left pause and what is to your right. Pause. Now we will change the scene to nighttime with the house lights turned on. The scene has changed to nighttime, and you are still standing in the middle of the living room, facing the south wall. You have been here before, and you know what is in front of you. Pause what is behind you. Pause what is to your left. Pause and what is to your right. Pause now the lights will go out. The lights are out, and you are standing in darkness facing the south wall. Although the living room looks dark, you still know what is in front of you. Pause what is behind you. Pause what is to your left. Pause and what is to your right. Pause. At this time concentrate on the wall before you, the south wall. You can sense it being a certain distance away, and you know what is on this wall. You also know the color of this wall. Use your memory, your knowing, your sensing, to make a study of your south wall. Scan this wall as you did the front of your home, beginning at the upper left corner and going from left to right, a little lower each time, until you reach the floor level. Study everything that attracts you, pictures, curtains, and furniture. Especially concentrate on objects that Contain color. Give yourself enough time to do this. Pause. You have practiced entering deep, healthy levels of mind. In your next session, you will enter a deeper, healthier level of mind, faster and easier than this time. Now when you are ready, count yourself out of your level. Take your time.